This does not suck. Yeah, in fact, this actually makes me quite happy. After a long winter, to have a great spring day like this, summer's almost here, this is great. What makes me angry, angry. Okay, well, maybe not that angry, but what does suck though are travel delays. The travel delays when you wake up and you think that you're gonna go to Chicago and have one of the best burgers in the US for dinner, only to find out that the front tire has a itty bitty leak in it, which hey, I'm <laughs> take care of that leak, don't get me wrong, but it delayed us by an hour. And when you only have a 45 minute layover, well, you kind of see where this is going. So instead of a video that's talking about the burger in Chicago, it's a video that's actually talking about the long layover. But don't feel too bad for me because, well, this layover actually turned out pretty damn cool. We are going to pursue what I think is the best burger in the country. It's in Chicago. Um, so anyways, it is 814. I've got an hour and 10 minutes until my flight leaves. Uh, but the great thing is, is that when you live in Spokane, uh, more than likely that's way too much time and I'm still going to be sitting for at least 10 to 15 minutes waiting for my flight. The house at 810 here at 840. All right, so change in plans. Just got delayed. We were delayed out of Spokane. I have about a six hour, God, I don't even know what time it is. Yeah, uh, six hour layover in Seattle before my next flight that I can get to Chicago. The only good news is, is that the Mariners are playing a day game. So I think we're going to do a change of plans and head down to Safeco Field. Okay, so thankfully I've got a fair amount of friends in Seattle and uh, one of them uh, is actually already at the Mariners game in a sweep. So I think he gonna, he's going to try to get me up there. So now I've got to figure out what to do with my, uh, with my carry-on bag. So I think I've got to check that into my backpack. I think I can still take into the game. So I should probably check that out. Well, that noise is annoying. So the cool thing is about Seattle is that there is a, the traffic here absolutely sucks, but there's a great tram that goes, uh, rail system, rent tram, rail system, whatever. It goes all the way down to Seattle and stops right at the stadium. I can't tell you how pumped I am for this. I mean, it sucks that I'm gonna be getting into Chicago at midnight, but I get to go to a baseball game, see a good friend of mine. I'll get to watch the Mariners play on a sunny day in April. It's gorgeous out, which just, it never happens here. The only time it's sunny in Seattle is July, September, July, August, and September. Those are the only months. And the rest of it's overcast and uh, just plain gloomy. So, we're gonna get, uh, we're gonna get on this tram, get a beer, in the stadium, of course, uh, and make this into a good day. Have I mentioned how pumped I am for this?
need to find my buddy Jeff, but oh my God, it is just awesome out here. So now I've got about two hours left on this layover, which is about the best layover that I've ever had. And uh, it's probably time to start working my way back to the airport to get through security so that I can get on my flight to hopefully get to Chicago so we can have that burger. All right, awesome time at the game. Um, Mariners got their butt kicks, but that's what they do. <laughs> they always get beat. So anyways, we are now uh, off to the airport. It is midnight in Chicago and we are getting tired. Ooh, it's been a long day. I think it's, it's always the day drinking that gets me, just every time. I mean, I'm not gonna complain because it was, uh, <laughs> it was a fun time, but man, always the day drinking. Uh, so now we gotta get through this kind of empty O'Hare airport and uh, get a car. Not quite sure if Hertz is trying to make this a Vegas lounge, but hey, I'll take it. So I was just told that because I'm president's circle. I don't know how to put this, but I'm kind of a big deal. Uh, I can pick anything on this floor, so shit. <laughs> Let's play the game of what do I want to draw? I'm gonna be honest, Hertz, you kinda outdid yourself on this one. Was not expecting myself to uh, hop into a, uh, to a Mercedes SUV, but uh, this works just fine. Uh, so I've made the executive decision that even though I was dead set hell bent on, uh, on getting a burger tonight, uh, <laughs> I'm tired and it's midnight and I've got an early business meeting, but we're gonna go to Osterville tomorrow. Opens at 11. Lines are typically long anyway, so if we get there at 11, we can hopefully beat the lines and then get on a plane and get the heck out. Uh, so anyways, there may be a couple more shots, but more than likely, I'm probably gonna see you in the morning. Okay, so it doesn't always work out that way. It actually never works out that way, right? But there is some unfinished business that we've got to do because the whole point of this video was to go to Chicago and try the burger at Achevel, and we didn't do that. So coming on 3 Minute Monday, it's going to be nothing but Achevel, the burger, and that experience. Thank you to Jeff to uh, bringing me in, letting me hang out for a little bit, and uh, you've always been a good friend, and it's always good to see you. If you liked the video, press like. If you really liked the video, subscribe. The next video is going to be 3 Minute Monday with the burger at Achevel. Until then, high five.